Happy Wednesday, everyone! It is really windy out here, so I'm about to go inside. We are here for another edition. flipping around for a second oh my goodness it's so windy crazy weather today here a little bit windy got some rain going on so happy Wednesday we're here for another edition of walk through Wednesday so hey Courtney hey guys I am just so excited to show you guys this is actually a great sneak peek I am here in the community of Heatherwood which is in McKinney but it's also Prosper ISD and many of you guys know about Heatherwood already because Heatherwood has four phases already built and actually I'm in the last final phase of Heatherwood which is going to be 2C and there's just over 60 lots available here and a brand new home builder is coming in. MI Homes is going to be building on all of these 60 plus lots out here and it's got two cul-de-sacs, oversized lots, got a green belt, lots of greenery right up by Ledbetter Park right here next to Baker Elementary. So beautiful, beautiful part of the community to jump on in. And in my homes actually um, is having their grand opening this Saturday. So we're getting a sneak peek of this model home and you guys just wait for it. So excited to show you guys this model home. It's got so much personality. It's just so beautiful. I can't wait to show you guys. So I'll stop talking and get to showing the house. All right. Walking into this home, you notice the grand entrance. Look at how beautiful this is. Right here in the front entryway, you can see the high two-story ceiling here in the front. It does have the crown molding up at the top. And look at the casing right here. Immediately to our right is the study. Now, we are in the Bel Air floor plan that MI Homes is building. It is uh, four bedrooms, three and a half bath. And this study right here to the front actually has an option that you can put doors. But in the model home right here, they have it open. And look at that casing. Isn't that beautiful? And on the walls, love, love the coloring here. Isn't that pretty? Open windows. So like I said, here in the Bel Air floor plan, you can um, put some doors here to make it more enclosed, but they do have it open. Hey, Cynthia, thanks for joining today. Courtney, I know, isn't this gorgeous staircase? Kind of wraps around. So to the right was the study. Right here to the left, a very popular option is the guest suite. So right up here at the front is a nice size guest bedroom. One of the secondary bedrooms down here with a full bath and you guys look look at this personality love love the tile look at the floor and it's got the subway tile there in the shower it goes all the way up to the ceiling great window for some light bright it's a great size bathroom in here it even has a closet see that right there for some storage so this is just the secondary bedroom down here, which is like I said, this is a perfect guest suite. It has the bedroom and bath, full bath right here at the front, right across from the study by the front door. Oh my gosh, you guys, this home smells so new. It is brand new. Just joining us. Hey, Ashley. Hey, everybody. I'm here in Heatherwood. I'm in 2C. It's the final phase of Heatherwood here in McKinney. It is Prosper ISD. There's about just over 60 lots right here. And in my homes, building some beautiful floor plans. And right now I'm in their Bel Air, brand new. Grand opening is actually this Saturday at 11. If you guys want to stop in, give me a call. I'll meet you here. So let me go around. There's the staircase and the formal dining. Okay, I have to point out something here, you guys. Look at these light fixtures. Look at that light fixture right there. Isn't that gorgeous? I'm loving all the light fixtures in this house. And I don't know if you missed it, but even 
right up here, see that front entry light right there? Kind of a modern right there in the study as well. There's a ledge right above the door just to kind of show you guys. Aw, <laughs> thanks, Christy. Cynthia, gorgeous bath. Aw, thanks. We miss you here in Heatherwood as well. So off to this, I'm sorry, I've walked right past the hallway here. This hall leads into the powder bath. So it's a nice little half bath right here. And again, this model home, they did a fabulous job decorating. Great colors, great tile selections. And that's the laundry room. And I'm going to kind of do a teaser because I want to show you guys that laundry room here in a minute. So let's come back over here into the living room. Hey, Courtney, eating your salad. Awesome. Well, this might give you a little bit of house fever. I'm not going to lie. It's giving me house fever. It's so pretty. All right, I'm going to kind of go over here. This is the living room. And right away, look at this fireplace. Subway tile. Now they're doing, um, similar to some other home builders, there's a switch on the wall right there that turns on that fireplace. I went ahead and turned it on before I walked through just to give it that homey. Yes, um, powder room. Oh, <laughs> that color. Christy, that's actually like a blue-gray. I'll go back around to show you up closer when we walk through the laundry room. So this is the living room. It has a great nook right there into the wall where you can put your TV. Roomy, light, bright. Look at those windows. Okay, guys, wait for it. Wait until you see this kitchen. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at this kitchen. Oh, I'm just so excited. Love this kitchen. Great size island, perfect for eating. Right up at the island, and there's that sink. Farmhouse sink in here, you guys. Isn't that cute? Love it. Now, they went with a quartz countertop in here, but if you notice, I love what they did with the two different colors. So they did black around the outside, and then they did a gray, and then they also did the cabinets. These are gray. It's kind of hard to tell in the light. I'll get a little closer. That's actually gray cabinets right up there, and then down here, they did white. Let me get a closer shot of this backsplash right here. Look at this. Isn't that gorgeous, you guys? Love, love, love it. I'm gonna flip you guys around. Hey guys, wow, there's so many of you guys here. Thank you so much for joining me today. For those of you just joining me, I'm in Heatherwood 2C. It's the last phase here in Heatherwood. It's McKinney, Prosper ISD, right here by Baker. Some great sized lots, lots of green belts, lots of greener you'll see here in a minute when I go into the backyard. I'm here in this gorgeous kitchen. I mean, look at these cabinets. Backsplash, and did you notice these little windows right here? Love it. I know, Courtney, you know, it's one of those things where you don't pick it normally, but then when you see it, it just really pops and adds that personality that like, okay, I would love that. And there's two little windows right there that bring in the light. And yes, Cynthia, you pointed out the butler's pantry. Love it right here. This is the butler's pantry. Some more cabinet space. And what I love about these cabinets is at the very top, it has the glass cabinets with the light. So when you look all the way around, you can see, I'm sure once you actually put stuff up there, it has to stay a little prettier with it being glass. And then right here by the butler's pantry is the pantry. And look at the great space in here. And I have to back up a little bit so you can see this door. Again, love the personality on the door. You see the glass? Awesome. Hey, Ashley, great question. In my homes is starting in the high 200s. They're starting in the 290s and go up. They do have some big cul-de-sac lots in here um, with a little bit higher lot premiums. I'll be happy to send those to you. Just send me a message. And these, this is the Bel Air floor plan, and I can get back up at the front, and we'll kind of look a little bit closer at their prices, and I'll put some pictures down in the comments with all the info so you guys can see it. But MI Homes brought their signature collection homes here in Heatherwood. So these homes have a little bit more personality, kind of more, I'd say, higher-end selections that you can pick from as far as upgrades and whatnot. And so the home I'm in is the Bel Air, and this floor plan is four bedrooms and three-and-a-half bath. And, you know, when I'm in a model home, a lot of times some of the things you see could be upgrades, could be standard. They did not have a sales rep here today for me to ask too many specific questions, but no fear, I have all the answers. So I'll get that for you. If you guys have any questions, just pop them on here. Thanks so much for watching. Let's go to the good stuff. Tired of hearing me talking, I'm sure. The floors throughout in here are beautiful wood, and you can kind of see the view from the kitchen. Hey, Kim, thanks for watching. 
Okay, you guys, I have to point out this dining area. Look at how spacious. You can see that they have room for a wine rack in front of the windows. And this is a huge round table in here with five chairs. And there's still plenty of room with windows all the way around. It just, it's got such an elegant feel in here. So gorgeous. Love the colors they went with. Now the lot they built the model home on actually backs up to the creek. So you can see all the greenery right here, all the tree lines. So there's a creek in there that separates this section. On the other side is Baker and Ledbetter Park. So they did do the wrought iron here along the back. And here in Heatherwood 2C, they have 50, 60, and 70 foot products on the different size lots. And you can kind of see over the fence, see all those lots available. Awesome, just such a pretty screen view. So sitting here on the porch, reading a book, it's really quiet out here. All right, we'll head back in to see the rest of the house. Awesome, okay, tucked over here is the master suite. I know, Courtney, all the lots are definitely beautiful. Great options with the green belt, the tree line. Here we are in the master, and you guys wait for it. Look up, shiplap. Who doesn't like a little shiplap in their master bedroom? That is gorgeous, you guys. Kim, great question. This is for, um, Heatherwood is in Prosper ISD. It's actually McKinney, but it's Prosper ISD. And the elementary school it feeds into is Baker, which actually is located right through those trees. So you're really close to the school here in Heatherwood. Let's go into this master. And I gotta tell you guys, I'm gonna warn you right now before we head into this master. Once you see this, there's no turning back. Wait for it, you ready? Oh, isn't that beautiful? Look at that shower. Oh my gosh, I fell in love with this bathroom first time I saw it. It's just so roomy, great tile wood, and it has the double vanity sinks here. And then I'm gonna get a closer look in here in the shower, you guys. I could not believe it when I saw it. Look at this shower, I'm gonna kinda go up. Great color options, it's actually a dual. This is a dual shower. So they're pretty much saying here in the master, go ahead and take showers at the same time. You got your own space, nice um, sitting ledge right there. I know, isn't that gorgeous, Courtney? Isn't that pretty? I, I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh. I don't think I have seen one similar to this in any of the model homes I've been through so far, but I'm loving it. I'm loving the colors. Again, they did the quartz countertop. Over there is a nice uh, closet for storage. And the toilet room. And guess what? It has a huge master closet with a little bit of light. Again, in my homes, really adds a lot of little windows here and there for that light and bright, really makes it um, seem a little more open. So pretty. Okay, and you guys know me. One of my favorite parts of these model homes is whenever a master closet opens up to the laundry room. Look at this laundry room, you guys. I know, Courtney, this closet, and I'm gonna pit back around here. This closet goes on and on. Think of all the shoes, all the dresses. Girls, come on, we can fill this closet. It even wraps around. Sorry, I have to go one more time. That wrap could be for all the men. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> all right, let's come back through to the laundry room. Look at what they did here. This is herringbone tile. Love the design with this. And immediately you notice there's a great mudroom set up right here with cabinets, the cubby holes. Wait for it. Look at this, you guys. Raise your hand if you do a lot of laundry. Wouldn't it be amazing to have this laundry room? There's still even more room right here with the plug if you wanted to put an extra fridge next to your washer and dryer. Great counter space for folding cabinets and again, windows. It just makes it so much more enjoyable when you can let natural light in. <laughs> All right, Kim. Me too, girl, me too. So that door right there would go to the garage and then it opens up back to the front entryway. So here in the laundry room, I'm gonna kind of turn the phone so you can see the whole setup. Mud room, master closet, laundry room. And what's great is when you come in from the garage, the kids can drop their backpacks. You can run to your room and hide. No, I'm just kidding. 
Come on in to the front. There's that powder bath. Hey, Christy Jacobs, if you're still watching this, I'll get a little closer. It's definitely a blue gray. I'd say it's definitely a mix of that family, but it's kind of got the blue hue to it. So I'm trying to show you in all the lights. I can get this paint color for you. I love how well it goes with this awesome tile they did in here. All right, guys, well, that's the downstairs. Let's head up this beautiful staircase. They did the wood on the stairs, which is awesome. Around. Hey guys, so thank you guys so much for watching with me. Right now we're in Heatherwood, and Heatherwood is in McKinney, but it's Prosper ISD. And Heatherwood's been around for a while. A lot of you guys have been here and know about the neighborhood. This is the final phase, this is 2C. And in my homes is building on just over 60 lots here in 2C, and they're offering some beautiful floor plans to pick from. They do start in the high 290s and up, um, and I can get you the full information. I have all the lot premiums, all the floor plans. We can hook you up. So let's look at the upstairs. All right, come on up, and they did this wood upstairs too. Love it. Right, Jennifer, that is definitely not their starting cost. Price point for this model is in the 400s, and I'm going to post um, the information when I get done here so you can actually see what the biller is going for. They actually, when they first um, posted the information for 2C, they had one price point and they did change it, but the grand opening is this Saturday, so they have it all ready. Look at this game room, you guys. It has the wood floors. This is the game room right upstairs. Now, this is one of my teaser picks. Look at this wall. Shiplap. This is a great rustic um, wood wall that they've done in the herringbone. Isn't that beautiful, you guys? I love this. It's a nice little um, barstool area, so if the kiddos wanted to sit and have a snack, do their homework. Now this is the media room option. So the media room option on this floor plan is an upgrade, but they did add the media room in this model home. Really great roomy. Love the color they did in here too. It's pretty much a basic media room, has the double doors, but it is tucked to the side, so it'll be much quieter to see a movie. And there's two more bedrooms up here we're coming around to. And again, these rooms are just great sizes. You can see by the big furniture. Great closet. Come back around to the bathroom. Hello. All right, now this bathroom opens up to the second bedroom up here and I'll kind of show you guys. On this side, it has a sink and a toilet with a shower. And then come in over here. It's kind of a half Jack and Jill because it opens up to just one of the bedrooms up here. But here's the sink in this side. So I'm gonna come back around so you can see it from this view. So it opens up to the hallway where those who are in the game room can come to the bathroom, but this bedroom has its own sink as well as the closet. And I'll show you guys the size. It's a great size. So this is another bedroom that's upstairs. Again, great colors. Nice size. You can tell by the big furniture in here. And a great view. So from here you can see that's Robinson Ridge. Robinson Ridge runs right into Heatherwood 2C now, where it goes right around to the school. But look at those lots over there, lots of great size. They've started building a few of their spec homes. All right. And you can see the view from the stairs. Look at how pretty. It has that ledge right there for decorating. You can see the casing down there on the steady in the front door. Beautiful, beautiful. Just such a grand entryway. Awesome. Hey guys. Well, thank you so much for watching me today. Again, this is Heatherwood. Heatherwood is a community here in McKinney. It's Prosper ISD. And actually, this is the final phase of Heatherwood. So this is um, phase 2C. And for those of you who are familiar with it, it's right over here by Baker and Ledbetter Park. And the floor plan I'm in today is their model home, which the grand opening is this Saturday, the 29th, with MI Homes at 11 a.m. If you can stop in, if you want me to meet you here, I will. So give me a call. I'll meet you here. We can walk through it in person. You'd really love to see this. Um, this is the model, which is the Bel Air floor plan. Yes, Courtney. Yes, two bedrooms up. 
and two bedrooms down. So this floor plan is four bedrooms, three and a half bath. It has that powder bath downstairs as well. Great floor plan, has the game room and then the media room option. It also has an option for a fifth bedroom if you wanted to, as well as doors on the study. Lots of great different upgrade options. As far as pricing, I mean, right now they're starting these floor plans in the high 200s and it goes up from there. Some of these bigger floor plans are in the four, three and four hundred thousands, but I'm going to post down in the comments some more information on the pricing just so you have exactly what they have right now. They do have some bigger size lots back here that are here in the cul-de-sac that ride against the tree lines, the green belt. I mean, it's beautiful so they do have some lot premiums on those and I have the complete info so I'd be glad to share it with you love to bring you out here to see it and my homes is new to the area they're from the Midwest um, but they've been building here for a while here in the Dallas area um, if you're familiar with Park Ridge here in McKinney that's where they're they started pre-selling Heatherwood out of but now that this model home opens on Saturday they're ready for you so give me a call I'll be happy to meet you here walk you through it get you some more information and I have to say personally Heatherwood is a great community to live in I happen to know a few people who live here and I think you would love it the community itself has a community pool a park um, it also has of course Baker Elementary which is Prosper ISD right here in the community and Ledbetter Park which is a city of McKinney Park but it's huge with a walking trail um, and there's tons of green belts lots of friendly neighbors um, it's a great community definitely um, family friendly my kids love to ride their bikes, and it's just a great community overall. So I'd love to show you guys this in person. Um, I'm with the MAR team, and just give me a call. Let us know if you need anything. Um, share your feedback. Ask your questions. would love to um, answer them and get all the information for you. So thanks so much for watching. Bye.